the shop behind me, behind you has been looted. You're the shop owner? Yes, I am. And what has the damage been? Oh, well, everything is broken. The doors are open. You can see my fridges are broken. My stock is taken. Everything of mine that belongs to me is gone. Everything. And how bad is the damage here? I mean, it looks pretty severe. Uh, look, I can't tell you how much is it. It's, it's too much. And how do you feel about this? How long have you been here? I've been here over a year. And how do you feel about the extent of damage that was done here and the protests going on at the moment? Look, I can't really say much. What can I say? I mean, there's no law in this country, so they just do what they want to. Now we must just pay for it. And um, explain to me what happened yesterday when you were here and you tried to come and extract some of your... Um... Well, I came in at about half past two. I tried to put diesel in my generator and as I was coming out, they were coming from this side, broke all the walls, throwing stones and... I tried to fight back, but there was too much in me. I couldn't, I couldn't do much. And what will you do now? Will you continue having a shop here? Will you... Oh, oh look, there's nowhere we can go. I mean, it's like I'm saying, I mean, after, uh, we, feed the, we, feed the, we feed the people in here. I mean, that's what they do to us. Where, where must we go? Where can I go? I mean, we'll try and rebuild it. I mean, it depends also on the landlord and the people. We just have to see what happens. You seem pretty despondent about what's happened. Yeah, yeah,